And now, it's time for your real estate video update with your local Louisville realtor, Bob Sekoler. Hi everybody, Bob Sekoler, Sekoler Medley team in the car on the way to a closing and an update now for our buyers and sellers and past clients with regards to the Louisville housing market conditions. It's been a lot of questions. How is the market doing? Here we are in April and I'm here to tell you that despite some published reports, the market is recovering and continues to do well. Tomorrow morning, it looks like snowfall will be diminishing in greater Louisville. Let's talk about what's heading our way. Ice, sleet, and freezing rain. Let's face it, weather forecasts like these don't encourage home sales. Buyers don't want to go out in the snow and sleet and freezing rain. That's why for the past three months, home sales have slowed. Who wants to get out in this stuff, right? And that's exactly why during the month of March of 2014, the number of homes that actually sold or closed was down 19.5% from a year before. But as the weather started to get better in March, people started heading outdoors and looking at homes. And the number of homes under contract in Louisville was actually up 8.7% compared to March of 2013. You can actually read more about home sales in the Louisville area by going to our blog, which is at WeSellLouisville.com, or send me an email and I'll sign you up for our newsletter that comes out once a month. It's absolutely free. For both buyers and sellers, take a look at this. It's an amazing display of how the market has improved. A year ago, we were seeing more foreclosures and short sales. Those were the homes selling between zero and $100,000. But as the market has improved over this past year, you'll see that more expensive homes are now starting to sell. In fact, homes priced at a million dollars or more are actually up 37.5% over just a year ago. Without question, this shows that there is confidence back in the housing market. We have our our own proof. We just closed on this million dollar home in the Spring Farms subdivision. We're proud to say after we took it over from another agent, we were able to get the job done. So who's buying homes these days? Well, 62% of home buyers are repeat buyers, but there's a whole new segment of buyers coming into the housing market, first time buyers, and they make up 38% of those out there looking for homes. And here's more good news. Buyers these days are smarter. They're saving to buy a home. In fact, 78% of all buyers now are using savings as their down payment money. In the past, buyers could borrow that extra down payment money from a bank, but those mortgages have gone away and the buyers have gotten smart and have been saving to buy a home. Now, looking towards the future, the time to buy looks like it's this year. And if you're going to sell, the same thing. And here's why. Interest rates are projected to go up above 5% by the first quarter of 2015. As you can see, interest rates are still historically low. But it's feared that if interest rates go above 5%, buyer activity could slow down. And for any first-time buyer still on the fence about buying a home, Trulia is reporting that it is 38% cheaper to buy a home than rent an apartment or a house. So here's what this all means. If you are a buyer and thinking about buying a home now, not later in the year, is the time. Now is the time to start looking. And by the way, with interest rates where they are, which are hovering around 4.5 to 4.65%, you can't get a better interest rate. This is a time to jump and find your perfect dream home. For sellers, it's now a good time to put your house on the market. And the reason, more important than anything else, is that there are fewer homes on the market, and that means that there's less competition amongst the sellers, and buyers may flock to your home. We put a home on the market yesterday. We're expecting a contract on it today at a well-priced home that's downtown. Not all neighborhoods perform that well, but I will tell you that for the most part, we see a lot of homes that come on the market. We sell them within a couple of days. If you need me or our team, we're here for you. Anytime, day or night, just give me a call on the cell phone at area code 502-376-5483. That's 502-376-5483. In the car, on the road, heading to a closing. I'm Bob Sekoler, Sekoler Medley Team, REMAX Properties East.